Hey family, it's me Lakeisha Marie and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited right now because I have my Juice by Julie Juice um, Cleanse. I bought the 3A Cleanse because I've seen so many videos on YouTube talking about the cleanse and how great that it is. So I was able to purchase a cleanse off of samsclub.com and I got the three day cleanse and it finally came in today. There were, you know, some problems with shipping, but I guess I could talk to you about that towards the end of this, towards the end of this video. So I wanted to show you, you know, how the um, package came. This is a little pamphlet of the cleanse guide, giving you a little information about what to do before the cleanse, what to do after the cleanse, you know, what to do if you decide to do the cleanse now or if you decide to wait to do the cleanse um, later. And it also talks about exercise as well and a little information about Julie there. And then also in the menu pamphlet here, it has some um, booster shots talks about seven different booster shots that you can also take, which is amazing. Um, the booster shots, I didn't even know they had booster shots, so that's you know some pretty good information to have. And then on the back side, there's different types of blended soups that you can um, eat as well. I guess Juice by Julie actually sells these particular soups, so you could probably go to their website to check out these soups. But just giving me the names of the soup is really giving me some different ideas because, you know, for the short period of time that I was actually a raw vegan, you know, I dibbled and dabbled in um, blended soups. And I really like them, you know, um, the colder soups. But these look like soups that, you know, can actually be warmed up, like the carrot ginger soup, the carrot, the carrot turmeric soup, of course, the potato leeks leek soup so these are warm soups that i can probably you know just you know experiment with to see if it's something that i can actually make at home and not necessarily get from juice by julie so let's go ahead and see what's actually in the box and how it actually came packaged so i am just now opening this up so you guys are seeing this with me for the very first time so these are the juices okay so this is the three day cleanse and i get six juices per day so as i drink each juice you know throughout the day i will just show you what it is that i'm drinking and give you what i give you an opinion of what i think you know as far as the taste and how i'm feeling in regards to hunger so this is going to be my way to actually detail my experience while being on this cleanse because i really would like to just cleanse up my body so i can kind of start over um on my health journey afterwards the plan after i do this cleanse the plan is to go vegan you know to slowly transition transition into vegan veganism because veganism i really like you know being a vegan you know just to have a lot of energy and just you know less brain fog it was just better i was just overall just was like healthier and happier while being vegan so i do plan to uh slowly transition back into vegan that's the reason for this clean as you can see i did get some booster shots as well um as you can see, I got four, you know, booster shots uh, for each day in these three different flavors. I have ginger, orange, lemon, and cayenne pepper, kava, and then chlorophyll and mint. So I am supposed to put these immediately in the freezer and just, you know, consume them when I feel like I just need a, a boost of energy. So yeah, guys, this is the three day juice by Julie Cleanse. Um, this is the initial um, packing. I'm going to go ahead and put all the juices in the refrigerator tonight and put the boosters, you know, in the freezer tonight because I'm going to actually start my cleanse tomorrow. So, yeah, guys. So, come on this journey with me for the next three days. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Hey, family. Good morning. It's actually a Wednesday morning. And I am on the go. This is the uh, first day of the three day juice by Julie Cleanse. So you really gonna be seeing me drinking this out and about around town for the most part at work and all that other good stuff. So I'm not just gonna be in the comfort of my own <laughs> drinking this juice, you know, drinking this um these juices. So 
Um, I'm having the first one in the car. This is the sweet span. This is the mango, pineapple, rice milk, spinach, banana, and water mix. So that sounds actually, that sounds pretty good. So we're gonna see. I like green juices, so. Um, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Well, if you guys, you, you guys are not gonna fall on me, right? You're not gonna tip over. So I actually like green juices, so it shouldn't, you know, so, you know, hopefully it's not that, it's not bad, but it sounds pretty good. Now, I did want to mention that the cleanse, she does say to uh, drink water throughout the cleanse and stay hydrated. Now, this is 16 full ounces, so we're going to see how this, uh, we're going to see how this works for me because, oh, it's only 140 calories. 16 ounces of juice and it's only 140 calories my smoothies at eight ounces is more calories than that wow okay and so so that's 140 calories you know what i'm gonna calculate the calories to see how many calories i'm taking in a day because i didn't even think about calorie intake but if you've seen my previous um vlog if you've been following me for a while you know that I went to a wellness center and found out that the um, maximum amount of um, calories for me, my body type, according to my weight, you know, according to um, how I, how much fat that I burn, according to like me and my age, you know, this was specifically for me, right? Um, my calorie intake. It's like 14 at the 1400, 14, as a matter of fact, 1450, about 14, 1450 calories. And that's, you know, with exercise, if I exercise that day. So, um, yeah, as far as exercise, oh yeah, let me mention that also. As far as exercise, I am going to go for a uh, three mile walk today with my Clarity Walk partner. No sweetness at all not at all even though it's pineapple I think I'm used to having almond milk in my smoothies and this is rice milk and this is my first time drinking rice milk I think yeah mm. not bad though It's a little, it's uh, a little chunkier than what I expected because it's a juice and it seems so um, smooth. But I guess that is to be expected um, because they, I believe, they do leave some of the fiber in the juices or whatever. So, so yeah. So that's me tasting the first one. I will check back in with you guys a little later to let you know how. Um, the rest of the juices go. I really hope you guys don't fall because I have re read this. So it's about three and a half hours later from my um, from the first juice that I had, and now I'm doing the second one, which is the spicy. Oh, you can't even see that. You can't even see that. But it's the spicy lemonade. It has lemon maple syrup and cayenne pepper. I can even see the cayenne in here. And this one is 80 calories. And um, yeah. So, and you know what the funny thing is? I've never done this mixture before because this particular mixture, mixture right here, I think it, Beyonce blew it up because she did it for a while. The lemon maple syrup and cayenne pepper detox or whatever and I never tried it so we're gonna try it together right now that's good oh. <laughs> and then there's a little fire right there mm. not bad at all I'm definitely going to enjoy this. This is probably something I'll do after the detox just because because it's actually really good. Mm -hmm. 
So I'm gonna finish this off. Another 16 uh, full ounces. It's two and a half hours later. Like I said, it's about 10:30 a.m. And um, I'm hungry. <laughs> I don't know if I'm hungry because I haven't ate any food or if I'm just hungry because I know that I'm not going to be eating salads for like the next three days. Just number three. Green radiance. Spinach, apples, strawberries, mango, coconut oil, and ginger. This does not sound sweet at all. <coughs> taste it together let me tell you something so today is january 9th and so january 1st i decided to do a no sugar challenge with um a couple of friends no sugar at all except for honey that's it and then they said um coffee too because they're huge coffee drinkers but that's neither here nor there but honey you know it's okay so i've been doing pretty good with staying away from sugar um i have been drinking a lot of tea good honey yes i can also have tea um while doing this detox i can also have coffee but with stevia i don't like stevia so i'm probably just gonna have plain coffee or plain tea um i am hungry right now and um i brought up the no sugar challenge because even though I'm hungry it's not as bad as if it would have been had I been eating a whole bunch of sugar up until this time because even in a pamphlet that I read it said to you know um, slowly wing yourself off of stuff before you take the detox so let's try it sweetness at all I'm okay with it because I like green juices but somebody else probably won't like this okay family it's time for juice number four this is the chia berry with chia seeds pomegranate strawberry lemon and agave this one is 160 calories. I didn't tell you the calories for the last juice, juice number three. It was 220 calories. So I did drink coffee, but I didn't even finish it because I'm like, why am I drinking coffee after that um, juice? But um, <laughs> I'm not excited about this one because I'm not too keen on chia seeds. Pomegranate seeds, um, yeah, I'm, I'm cool with that. But chia seeds, I don't know. Because chia seeds can make your drink seem, you know, thick. So, I don't know. And the fact that it has 28 grams of sugar, but it's not going to be sweet at all. So, let's see um, how it tastes. tart um, this you can definitely taste the seeds mm. and I feel like there's probably like um, strawberry seeds in here too or little small chunks of strawberries Type of person that's real big on um, the consistency of your food, you may have a little bit of a problem with it, but overall, it's not bad. It is, let's see, three hours. No, it's two and a half hours later from the last. Truth, then I want to get rest things on my shirt. Two and a half hours later from the last juice, 
I am hungry. I'm thinking about food a lot, at least when people bring it up. Like somebody just brought up my Giannos and I was just like, ooh, I can go and get like fries and kidney sticks. No, you can't, you're on detox. Number five, watermelon wizard. Watermelon, pineapple, strawberries, lemon juice, rosemary, maquis powder. 170 calories. And 29 grams of sugar. I'm over it. I'm ready to eat something already. I'm just ready to eat some salad. Sweeter than what I thought. Again, the consistency is thick for it to be a juice. It's sweeter than what I expected. Not bad, it's good. It's like two hours later. So this will be for the ride home. I am on juice number six of the day and um, I'm hungry. Am I really hungry? I just want some salad food is, is what it is. I just want some salad food because it's like I went all day with no salad food and I think my body is just going through withdrawal of just eating something salad. Um, not necessarily craving anything sweet per se. I just want to chew on something if that makes sense jeremy went to popeyes after work so you know i procrastinated on purpose asking him for some of his food to give him a chance to eat it all up and my plan worked i did ask him to bring with some stream beans back because with the detox you can have steamed vegetables but he reminded me there's stream beans in the refrigerator because i cook stream beans um uh, as a part of dinner the other night but I don't want to really eat those stream beans because it has, you know, garlic, um, salt, and powder, and all those other seasonings on it. So, and butter, of course. So, um, and then I also made me some sweet potatoes the other night. And those, in sweet potatoes, I sprinkle a little bit of coconut sugar on top and um, cinnamon. And I just like, and roasted it. And I'm just like, I don't want to do that either. But anyway, this is. Oh, extreme greens extreme greens you know i just had a huge side because it has lime in it spinach kale orange pineapple hemp seeds and lime so this is definitely not going to be sweet at all um it's 140 calories and it's 18 grams of um sugar so I don't know if I'm going to continue this, guys. I really don't know if I'm going to continue. <sighs> well, at least I got through day one. Tomorrow, I'm just going to have to really get up a little or start drinking my juices a little earlier in the day so I can get all six of them in. So the last um, three juices of the day, I'm not drinking them so close together. So I can space them out just... A little bit more so I can just get them all in I don't even know what time it is as opposed to drink this two hours before I go to bed which is about eight o'clock it's probably about that time now close to that time anyway but it doesn't matter because I want something so here we go not bad I feel like it smells like something, but I don't smell it. Actually, not bad. I am really pleasantly surprised because of this lime. It's still not sweet, but it's not bad. For a juice, it is chunky. So... That consistency thing, depending on how you like consistency. Mm. Mm. 
So that's this. I'm gonna finish this while I get some more some more work done. So not sure I'm gonna finish this this detox, but I'll let you know if I finish the detox the detox over the next couple of days and my final thoughts. Okay family, welcome back. It is day two of the detox detox and I'm on uh, juice five and the reason why you just not seeing me on day two at juice five is because one through four were the exact same as yesterday. One number five is a little different. Number five is PB and juice. Okay. And it has all natural peanut butter, strawberry, banana, and rice milk. Now why does it have to be peanut butter? Why couldn't it just be almond butter? Really? Remember that test I took a while back when I went to the wellness center where it came back saying that I shouldn't um, have peanuts. I'm not allergic to peanuts, but they just don't do the best in my system. So this is 100 calories, 10 grams of sugar, and um, yeah, all natural peanut butter, strawberry, banana, and rice milk. So we got to see what this tastes like. I'm about to order a pizza because that's where I am right now. There's a pizza um, parlor parlor around the corner from my house and I'm about to order me a pizza so I can go and pick it up as soon as I get on my side of town and sit down and have me a nice slice of pizza. Yes, this is real life right now. I'm being 100% honest with you because I need something solid. rice milk throws it off but it's not bad okay guys it is day three i'm on juice number two spicy pomegranate it is pomegranate pomegranate lemon maple syrup cayenne pepper no deal day three this is a new juice that's why i didn't show day one so i'm only showing the new juices on today This is my favorite. Hey family, so I am about to drink juice number five, Coco Nana. Nana, Coco Nana. It has cocoa, banana, strawberry, pomegranate, coconut milk. Oh, I like coconut milk, so this should be good. This is 220 calories. I didn't say how many calories the last drink was, but let's see what this one tastes like. And number six, I think it's the same as um, yesterday's drink. So let's see how this tastes. No sweetness at all. so the three day juice by julie detox is officially over thank you jesus and so i just want to tell you about um the last three days so i've i've showed you all the different flavors of the juices that came in the package i did the three day cleanse where i got six juices per day and so pretty much every day it was the same as the same exact juices but they may have added like you know one or two juices that was different on day two and day three or really however you really like you know put it together for yourself because those juices those um juices that were different they were numbered because all the juices do come number numbered you know in the different order that you should drink them and the ones that were of different flavors didn't have a number on them so i'm assuming that you can like uh, mix it up however you want to mix it up there wasn't really any direction um that came with the package that talked about that but anyway so i got through the three days of 
detox cleansing. Now, the last clip or the clip before last when I talked about I'm about to go home and get some pizza. Um, so <laughs> I was like, I'm about to go home and get some pizza. I decided, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna order the pizza before I leave. It'll be ready when I get home. And I was like, nah, I order when I'm in the car. I get in the car and I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna go home and cook Jeremy some dinner. Don't need to order a pizza. I get home and what happened? I had completely forgot that Jeremy took the day off that day. He, he had already cooked the DiGiorno's pizza that was in the freezer. So, it, it was just too much. I couldn't deal. So I went ahead and I had a slice of pizza. He was laughing at me, but whatever. So I had a slice of pizza and I did not have the less juice on that night. As of right now, as I'm recording this video, I still haven't had that less juice, to be honest with you. Because if you're not going to drink the juices within the three days, you have to put them in the freezer. So I'll unfreeze it. I take it out the freezer tonight so I can have it tomorrow. But anyway, so I had to slice the pizza and I did not have that last juice because even though it was, um, the juices were all low calorie and I, as I'm recording this video, I did not, um, add up the calories, but I told you the calories are each juice. So maybe you can go back and add it up yourself. So even though the juices were low calorie, I was getting in low calories for the day. I still didn't, you know, have the juice on top of the pizza. Cause number one, I thought that was number one counterproductive. And then even though I didn't have a lot of calories, I still felt full because of all the juice that I had consumed that day. So I did not weigh myself before the detox. So I did not weigh myself after the detox. And um, because weight loss wasn't why wasn't the reason why I decided to do the detox. I just really wanted to clean out my system so I could start over with eating healthy and eating right. Because I decided to transition into vegan veganism again. So I'm doing a slow transition into veganism. Um, I think I mentioned prior that January 1st, I decided to do a no sugar challenge with... A friend of mine and so I was on day nine of the challenge by the time my juices came so I think by going nine days with no sugar outside of honey really helped me to really get through those three days because I didn't have your normal um, cravings for sugar I didn't have the normal withdrawals from sugar you know going through the detox and actually in the um, literature that came with the juices it specifically says to you know slowly wean yourself off of certain foods before taking a detox you know don't just go cold turkey and take the detox so overall i felt really good you know i felt really good after the after the detox um i did not work out during the detox because it kind of uh because the literature said not to work out during the detox unless you feel able to, but they didn't, um, you know, condone it. So I did not work out during it during the detox. The detox for me ended on Friday. I went to the gym that Saturday and I felt really good in the gym. Um, you will go to the bathroom a lot to do number one. You know, you would do number two as well, but it's not like on the same level as you going and getting like an enema or something like that hopefully that's not tmi but hey i wanted to give you the real real so um yeah the juices were okay will i do this juice cleanse again eh, probably not probably not i won't um there was a, a a lot of confusion with the shipping so even though because i ordered my juice cleanse um, pretty much the first week of January and it took you know no the last week of December I ordered my juice and I'm supposed to receive it January 3rd I didn't get it until January 10th and that was because I ended up calling Sam's because I ordered it through Sam's and I called Sam's and Sam was like okay we'll just send you the juice as opposed to juice by Julie because originally the juice was supposed to come from New York so I don't know sales club got involved next thing you know I had my juice the next day so I did the cleanse, but the shots, the little shots that I showed you 
in the you know in the previous um, footage I haven't taken those shots you are to put those in the freezer until you're ready to have them um, I've taken one shot today it was the Kala shot I let it unthaw like I took it out earlier today and I let it unthaw and it was pretty much unthaw because you know it's about like like this and so it was completely unthawed by like 11 so I just took the shot I didn't feel anything different or anything like that I think the shots are supposed to like give you like a boost of energy or something like that I didn't have a boost of energy who knows maybe with the other shots I would feel you know I would have that boost of energy I don't know so if you want to do you know a vegan cleanse um, that's really low in sugar then definitely do it um, five days I don't know I wouldn't do it for five days because I just really had the urge to really just chew something like that was you know my craving to just chew not nothing sweet not even anything fat I just wanted to chew something so yeah that's the cleanse I don't have any before or after pictures because again that's not the reason why I took the cleanse just really want to clean out my system so I can start fresh with eating you know um right as far as transitioning to veganism and you know just flush out my system so I can start taking my vitamins you know and stuff like that just wanted to kind of like right the slate clean do I think it did that eh. I don't know but um yeah that's really all that I can think of because I told you you know I filmed throughout each day of the three days of the cleanse um and I think that's it you guys do I recommend you you do the cleanse why not it can't hurt why not um take the cleanse because you're definitely getting enough juice where you're not really getting hungry and staying hungry for a long period of time oh let me mention that too the day one of the cleanse i started off doing three hours i started out doing every three hours and then you know the last i think four hours i was like cramming them in so i was drinking like every hour and a half two hours because i needed to take juice number six two hours before um whatever time i went to bed so day number one, I started taking the juices at 7. And so I normally go to bed around 10. So I needed to have taken all six juices by 8 p.m. And so between 4 and 8, I was like cramming them in. Like I had like 3 or 4 to like cram in. So day two and day three, I started at 5 a.m. Because normally at 5 a.m. is when I get up to meditate, do my spiritual studies, and just be, one with, be at one with my thoughts. So I started taking the juices at 5 and then would take the juices, drink the juices every three hours. And that worked perfectly for me. I was able to you know do all my juices by eight o'clock without having to cram them in and then by the time i started to get hungry feel hunger pains it was time to actually drink the next juice because it was three hours later so just a little tip if you decide to you know do the detox try to go as start as early in the day as you can unless you want those night if unless you like a night owl and um you know spread it out spread it out for every three hours and you should be okay so yeah that's all i have for you thank you so much for watching this video because it's a lot longer than my usual usual videos but i want to put all this in one video as far as a review if you have any questions please leave them in the comment section below and i would definitely loop back around and answer your questions if you are meeting me for the very first time welcome hit the subscribe button so you become a part of the family all oh, my old heads please ring the bell so you can get notifications every time i upload a video and please share with your family and your friends who want to do a detox to just start the new year off right why not please share my video i really appreciate you and uh yeah that's all i have for you guys and i'll see you in the next video peace